What's going on YouTube? Just want to talk about this uh, controllers for all uh, and uh, give you a little tutorial how to connect to it. Uh, it's pretty easy. You're going to need an iOS device. Uh, you're going to need either an iPad or an iOS, an iPhone. A six axis controller. Pick one up on Amazon. I've had this one around for forever. And your USB cable and also a some type of PC so either Linux or Mac or Windows doesn't matter I currently have a Windows computer right here and the program you're going to download I'm gonna put down in the description is from dancingpixelstudios.com uh, it's this little device this little program called Six Axes Pair Tool Setup. Pretty much the same tool that you use with Blue Troll to input the Bluetooth address that you would find in the general about and scroll down in uh, in your iOS device. So uh, pretty much you're going just to go to you're going to get this little address that's in your settings so here's settings you're gonna go to general and then about without giving me my information you scroll down and it should be down there on the bottom where it says Bluetooth so you're gonna take that and you're gonna install that program and pretty much set up your controller that way now over to the actual uh, iOS device I'll do a little tutorial how to download that and everything so alright so here it is here is Cydia and you're just gonna type in controllers and you'll see the one from modmyiphone.com uh, it's a dollar ninety nine or you could download the free one from insane uh, iPhone either one uh, I'm actually gonna just buy it because it it works for me and I got tired of waiting for Blue Troll. So um, here it is. I actually bought Blue Troll and uh, been waiting for the update. But uh, this one, I'm purchasing this one. So uh, you just go over to settings. You're going to make sure that uh, your Bluetooth is. Uh, let's see, where is it? Where is it? Uh, controllers for all. Okay. So here's <coughs> controllers for all. Basically, here's instructions. You can email your buddies or you can read the instructions. You get an option to email it. Mac, it's pretty easy. Windows is pretty easy. Linux is a little bit more in-depth, but if you're, you're working with Linux, then you know what you're doing. So uh, you're going to make sure that your Bluetooth is off. And uh, if you're either connecting to... Let's see, you got to make sure your Bluetooth is off. So you're going to go over to, nope, oh, it crashed, sorry about that. Bluetooth is currently on, so I'm going to turn that thing off. I'm going to scroll down, check my BT stack, make sure that thing's working right. So I'm going to connect to a PS4 controller, which I don't have, but I'm just showing you that you can do either or. So uh, that's about it on that. So back to the other thing. <clears throat> I've already uh, installed this program already. It's in Cydia. So you're going to go to settings. It's going to go down to controllers for all. You're going to pick, pick what type of controller you have. Whatever it is. Uh, whether it's a PS4 controller. If you have a PS4 controller, you're going to connect it right here. If you have a PS3 controller, you're going to connect it via the game that uh, supports the actual Bluetooth, Bluetooth controller. Make sure you have your, um, your uh, Bluetooth off if it's not already off after you install it because it uses uh, uh, BT Stack, which is right here. And uh, it's already activated on my device. So... 
So without further ado, I'm going to go over to the actual game, which is uh, the game that I originally wanted it for. So pretty much it's going to initialize searching for a Bluetooth controller, press the PS button. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to press the center button and connect it to a controller. It does that automatically. That's the reason why you don't want to disable notifications because you're going to need that. I'm going to skip this. So pretty much you're connected. Here's your, your uh, PS controller right here. And um, I'm going to press this button, press the X button. Alright, so uh, this light's going to bug. So it's, um, first of all, let's walk around. And uh, with your Apple TV, you can go over, scroll up, go to AirPlay, and uh, put it on your um, your TV in the front room, or your bedroom, or whatever, wherever your Apple TV is located. I currently have mine in my bedroom. So, um, that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you. Give me a thumbs up. If you liked the video, leave your comments below. Be nice. Thank you.